What's up everybody, it's your boy Moses uh, and I'm back again. Uh, Happy New Year. It's my first video putting out in 2021. Ah, mm. uh, yeah, it is much. I know, it's crazy, right? It's been a good 2021 so far. But yeah, I'm back. And I'm here to just give you an update, you know, what has been happening, what's going on, you know, uh, with the channel and all of that. So, you know, we all have an idea for 2020 was. Everybody, you know, it's been a blessing to be alive in 2021 uh, but 2020 was tough and um, it's been emotionally you know traumatizing i would say maybe that's a big word but yeah i had a little bit of my own share of 2020 uh emotionally i was just so down and even with the start of 2021 some of you have an understanding, you know, I got married last year, but my wife is still in Nigeria and, you know, we'll be joining in very soon by faith. We received that and it's not been easy, you know, trying to, trying to juggle everything together. Um, I've been so stressed out <laughs> with, with managing myself and, uh, you know, keeping company of my wife over the phone and we just whatsapp and facetime all day all night but hey we gotta make it work but yeah um that has been happening and also uh been doing a lot of music production a lot of mixing services for all the producers uh and a lot of uh church programs that i've been part of been blessed to be part of and uh Thank God for that. But now I'm back again and I want to take you guys on a whole new journey, on a whole new level. So if you all remember the channel back in 2020, back in 2019, back in 2020, uh, I was just in my bedroom studio where everything was so cramped. Oh my God, I remember that room. Mm -hmm. You guys remember the room. Check the old video. Yeah, go check it out. You see, you see what I'm talking about. So cramped space, uh, all the gears, all the bedroom. I work from home, uh, produce music from the place, but it's just not enough space for me anymore. And we needed to just expand. So uh, myself and my buddy Taiwo, we moved out, and you know he helped me so so much to be able to move into to the new apartment we we move into, and it's a two bedroom house where I can uh, make one of the bedroom a studio and the other bedroom just a master bedroom. Also, where I can still work uh, professionally from home. By the way, I'm by profession a, a pipeline engineer. We. I don't even want to go into the details of that. Bow you with that. Come on, YouTube. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I still do all of that every day, nine to five. But I'm hoping, you know, to push this a little bit forward in a way we, uh, which is support, we can go forward from where we are right now and be able to keep giving you guys consistent content every other week. So. And we're putting things in place and I'm about to show you some of the stuff. So get ready. Let me take you on a quick trip and let's go. All right. So we're just going to go into the studio right now. Uh, this is one of the bedroom and this is the other bedroom where the studio is. And here it is right here. Uh, I won't take much of your time. So just had the MIDI controllers. I'm gonna be reviewing this MIDI controller at some point. It's a really, really, really good MIDI controller. I've been using it for the past uh, three months, I believe. Got it on a good deal of Black Friday last year and it's really been a good, good MIDI controller. I've been enjoying every function it has to offer. Uh, I still use my 88 Keys Hammered Action Studio Logic SL880, that's the one. I bought it from eBay for like $250. Really, really good deal for me. He's been using it for almost two years right now. And it's been a good, a good one. So yeah, highly recommended. You don't even have to buy new. You can't even find new one, but 
you can find the old one which is really nice um over here we got the yamaha hs8 studio monitor still use my macbook pro 2015 actually this is a late 2013 16 gig gram core i7 quad core really really good uh it does everything i needed to do so why bother by the way we're gonna upgrade at some point but for now if it doesn't break don't fix it now this is my audio interface complete audio 6 by native instrument i use this mouse i probably will review this mouse at some point the logi mx master 3 for mac and pc i connect three computers to this thing uh i just click a button under there and changes to the other computer and everything just worked right I, in fact i'm gonna review this thing it's crazy helps my workflow a lot and here the new addition to the studio platform nano midi controller this guy right here is a beast speed up my workflow you can be a producer you can be a mix, mixing engineer without some form of fader because you don't want your mixes to be static you gotta make a move so this guy right here you can do automation with ease 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 easy automation and uh, over to this side we got the microphone i use the aston uh aston spirit microphone inside there and this regular stuff right here uh, is what I used to kind of like shoot the whole thing away from away from um, noise and the echo in the room. You could possibly hear the echo in my voice right now. Over here, yep. My Fender P bass guitar. I don't know what year it is, but hey, that thing sounds so good and fat and round. If you know what I mean, you know uh the headphones the hd 6 double x are the mass drop version of the sennheiser hd 600 or hd 650 i can't remember which particular one and i have the m50 access audio technical studio standard you won't have one of these and if some of you remember from my um, video where i was playing since we just jesus molina uh video i was using this midi controller still functioning perfectly well right now i like it at some point it started messing around but hey it's working nice now so i'm good with that one we got a little chair in the studio right now if you know got somebody in the studio they can always have a seat and uh yeah that is a quick studio tour just for now but wait a minute i got some things coming up at some point but I'm gonna show you the ones we have right now. You could hear the echo in this room. The acoustic in this room gotta be dope. And we got a solution for that. So let me take you down to show you what we got. Right here. Whoa! We got some nice stuff in here. So uh, some of you in the acoustic world may know these people, Prime Acoustic, and we have some studio panels coming up this is a studio panel this is the london 10 room kit london 10 room kit it has like eight big panels and uh about 12 uh scatter blocks this is like a demonstration of what it looks like and how you set it up in your studio and we got the best bass trap you can get from prime acoustic the max strap this bass strap right here oh my god it's gonna do some amazing work and of course over the mixing position we got two ceiling cloud the prime acoustic also by the way i'm not sponsored by prime acoustic i'm just showing you what we got going on to fix the uh echo in that room and then we have all of this the ceiling cloud there's so many, many good reviews about this company, Pramacaustic, and uh, I'm, I'm excited what we got coming up. Now we have a lot of bunch of stuff inside here, Amazon stuff, bunch of other Amazon stuff, but hey, we got a camera, oh my God. 
A7 III, half a 7 III, Sony half a 7 III. Oh my God, I can't wait for you to see what this camera is going to produce. Crazy, crazy content. We got uh, stands, lights. Oh my God, a lot of goodies inside here. Probably we show you a lot of all the unboxing of this thing and the process definitely of installing all of this acoustic panel and what the room sounds like right about now and what it's gonna sound like when we're done, and when we're ready now, what the room will look like when we have everything fixed up. All right, so don't mind the mess right now. It's gonna be cleaned up and it's gonna look perfectly fine. And really, really good content is gonna be coming up. All right. So yeah, this is what I got to show you guys right now. And uh, I can tell you really, really good stuff for coming. Just stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. Like this, uh, drop comments, you know, let me know what kind of content would you like to keep seeing. Music production content, tutorials, sound design tutorials, uh, pianos, gospel keys, whatever. Just hit me up, let me know in the comment section. I'll be glad to engage. I just wanna know what you guys wanna keep seeing consistently. That will help me to bring you what you would like to see, right? So, uh, God has been faithful to give us a couple of things that we can share with the world, you know? And I just wanna know, bring you the best, bring you the best of the best. So help me bring you the best of the best. Let me know down below in the comment what you what you personally would like to see. Find out. Just drop a comment below. All right. Thank you. Make sure you smash the like button. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't. Uh, yeah, support the channel by engaging. Appreciate every one of you. Peace out.